The 28 WNBA season is projected to be packed with Latino flavor, after an offseason full of hype with the arrival of number one overall pick Kaylin Clark. Players of Latin American descent will hope to steal the spotlight throughout the year. This season, six Latinas will be on opening day rosters across the league, with Diana Taurasi leading the pack. The Argentine American is one of the most legendary players in the sport. She's set to establish a new record for the most WNBA seasons played, when she suits up for her 20th campaign with the Phoenix Mercury in the season opener against the Las Vegas Aces. She's the only player in league history to score more than 10,000 points, and after the three-time WNBA champion, the rest of the players on this list have little to no experience in the W. Out of the six Latinas in opening day rosters, three of them are rookies, and two are yet to make their debuts in the league. Brazilian Camila Cardoso is projected to have a big rookie season, coming off a national championship title with South Carolina. She was selected by the Chicago Sky with a third overall pick. The six foot seven forward will be one of two Brazilian born players this season, joining Dallas Wings forward Stephanie Suarez. Rookie guard Celeste Taylor will be Kaylin Clark's teammate in Indiana. Taylor, of Colombian and Puerto Rican descent, spent her last season at the collegiate level with the Ohio State Buckeyes, helping the team to a Big Ten regular season title and a run to the NCAA tournament. The other Latina set to make her WNBA debut this season is Esmeri Martinez. She became the first Dominican-born player to be drafted in WNBA history when Delivery selected her with a 17th overall pick in this year's draft. Last but not least, Lou Lopez and Eshaw will hope to make her WNBA debut after missing the previous season due to any injury. In 2023, Lopez and Eshaw became the first Mexican-born player in league history to be drafted when the Dallas Wings selected her with the fifth overall pick. Due to roster limitations, two other Latinas didn't make the cut for opening day rosters. Leilani Correa, drafted by the Fever earlier this year, was weighed just a few days ago, while teammate Damiris Dantas also saw her contract temporarily suspended by Indiana.